and welcome back to Luxury and Life. So today's a really exciting video because it was my 31st birthday yesterday and I'm going to be showing you everything that I got, or well, the main things anyway, because I love watching these videos, I love seeing what everyone else has got. It's not in any way a bragging video, it's just I want to share the things that I really love with all of you. So if you're interested, keep on watching. So I'll go through some of the kind of little bits I got first and then I'll get onto the really good stuff, the stuff that I know you were here for. So I'll get onto them last, but just firstly, I got a lot of chocolate. I love chocolate. So I got this little kind of chocolate bar here. I got some milk tray, which are really, really good. These are amazing if you haven't tried them. They are, how do you say it? Gillian, Gillian? Belgian chocolates anyway, but they are just absolutely delicious so I love them and of course I got some more teasers teasers so I'm going to be working my way through all of those I love a bit of chocolate on a night with a cup of tea so yeah I can't wait to eat them um one of my sisters got me this really nice um candle and diffuser set it's a scent called midnight orchid so I really love just having these around the flat just to make it all smell really nice so it's hard to describe what this is like but it's not sweet it's kind of like a a musky sort of it's just a really really nice scent and i think they are kind of meant to be a little bit similar to jo malone kind of they look a bit like that and yeah they just smell gorgeous so really happy with them um another one of my sisters i've got three sisters so another one of my sisters just got me a mug which i'm drinking out of right now and it just says fabulous sister so that's really cute I love stationery and notebooks and with me working from home at the minute I'm always writing things down to do lists just I love just writing everything down so my sister and my niece got me these two really nice little notebooks um they're both really really gorgeous so this one is just kind of like a journal it says life is a journey take notes along the way and it's just black and gold and inside you've just got lined paper and then it's got space for the date there so I can just use this for anything really. I think I might might use this for work but yeah it's a really good size and I love that it's kind of flexible and it'll fit nicely in most of my bags so I love that one. This one is kind of a rose gold with a pink with the letter K on there for my initial and I love the edges as well I've just got that foil fold edge and again this is just lined paper so yeah I love a bit of stationery so I can't wait to look at those so I love all those little bits the next things are kind of things that I kind of knew about things that I hinted at things that I kind of dropped in here and there that I might like to get so the first thing is this book which my mum and dad got me and it is the Louis Vuitton City Bags in Natural History so it's huge it's really heavy and it's just got basically the history of Louis Vuitton bags it's got some amazing amazing details in there it's got how everything is made how everything's kind of evolved from the beginning it's just it's just amazing so it's got some really good like photography and everything in there and it's just I can't wait to read this I'm going to be an expert by the end of this but I just think it's a really really good it's highly highly recommended the reviews were great so I can't wait to look through this if you're anything like me, you will always get yourself a little present and I definitely, definitely did that. It was no exception this year. So I was looking around for some jewellery and this is the necklace that I purchased for myself. So it's from a quite a new small brand called Miani and they do reworked Louis Vuitton pieces. So it came in this little box. I'll just show you. So it came with their little business card. I'll leave all the details down below for where you can find this website. This really cool little Instagram card on there where you can follow them. A little, I think it's a little mint with Miani on there. And then yeah, so it just came packaged nicely in here on this little cloth and I'll come closer so you can see. So the one I picked up is made from a Louis Vuitton charm bracelet. So it's just got the the little kind of flower emblem on there it's kind of really really dark brown almost black and it's just on this rope chain necklace she has a lot of different chains so you can choose any chain that you want and i think now she's just released a new collection with the 
the charms in all of the, the kind of bright colours so I'll leave the details down below because I really really like this I think the chain length is perfect I love that it's not too obvious it's not too in your face it's just the little flower detail so only like only real Louis Vuitton fans will know what this is and what it kind of represents so yeah I really like this I don't normally splurge on any jewellery to be honest I, I don't really have that much so I just like this and I think it'll, I can even double up and wear some other necklaces with it. Yeah, I'm really happy with that one. Okay, so we're on to the really exciting pieces now, the things that I know you are here for. And so I kind of went and got one thing for myself and one thing was from my boyfriend. So he packaged them all up really nicely, put them both together in this little box. Um, it came as well on the box with this little ribbon which is my friend's new business so it just has my name in gold on this beautiful beige ribbon i'll leave the website in details down below where you can look you can get them in all different colors they're just really nice ways to kind of package up your presents or even for weddings she does little favors on the tables and yeah i just think they're really really cute so i'll leave the details for that down below but i loved how that was kind of on the box and then inside so he filled it all with multicoloured tissue paper just to match the items inside and in there is, I hope this does not fall out, um, the multicolour pochette accessories, the old model, and the cosmetic pouch. I was just over the moon to see these. I did know about them. Um, one of them I picked for myself and the other one I kind of picked as well but I wasn't sure if I was going to get it for a good price because of these do go for a lot of money um, but I'll just show you them in a bit more detail so this one is definitely a bit older it's definitely more worn more pre-loved you can tell by the dark fachetta on there but I just I can't believe I managed to get this and I'm gonna do a more detailed video about how I got these pieces how much I paid for them where I found them all of that so watch out for my next video for these in a bit more detail so that's the pochette this one is in a lot better condition as you can see the the monogram is just so nice and bright the rochetta on the sides is in really good condition i think it's just got maybe it's on this one a tiny tiny little watermark but it's just in really great condition. So I love the size of this. I think I've got a Toyota 15 and sometimes I do find it a little bit small. Um, so I think this will be, be a lot better for in my daily handbag. So I can't believe I got my hands on these. So, but as I said, look out for my next video where I'll be giving you way more details on both these pieces. So going back to the pochette, I knew that this strap probably wasn't going to work for me. It is small. I mean, you can just carry it like this, but I think for over the shoulder, it is it is tight and it just kind of hits you right under the armpit. So I knew I wanted to get some different straps for this. I mean, I will carry it like this sometimes, just kind of over my arm or just in my hand like this. But for other times, I think I would like to invest in some more straps just to make it even more versatile. So I did order a couple. I'll show you those now. The first one I'm a bit disappointed with because it was really cheap from Amazon. So I wanted one that could be one crossbody. I got one with some black leather just to go with the black in the pochette. And then I got the gold chain, but I think the chain is just just too thick and it's quite yellow as well and in your face. So I'll try it on. I'll show you what I mean, but I just I just don't think it's right for me. I think I need something a bit more dainty because the pochette is is a bit dainty as well and I think this just takes away from it a bit too much so as you can see I just I just don't like this chain I think it is just too in your face I'd like something a bit more subtle just to go with the pochette um I don't mind the black even if this was all black leather it might might be a bit nicer but yeah I think this chain just just isn't for me so it was only cheap so it, it won't matter um but yeah I'll, I'll keep looking for another crossbody chain the next one i got i am actually really happy with this was just from etsy and um, it's kind of the same kind of untreated leather so this will go darker over time so it will match 
the bruschetta on the bag a little bit more um but it's just a little bit longer so it won't hit me where it hits at the moment so when i wear it like this it's just far far better like this it's not so high up whereas the other one was here it's kind of more more like this i think this is how i will wear it most of the time if not crossbody i'll wear it like this so yeah i love love how that looks so if you know of any other good straps for the pochette do let me know as i said I don't think I'm going to be using this one, but I'm going to keep a lookout for some kind of more daintier straps. And yeah, I just don't think I'm going to use this one. So if you do know of any good ones, please do comment down below so I can take a look. So that is everything. I'm really happy with everything that I got. I also got lots of lovely cards and I got a bit of money as well from my family. And yeah, just over the moon, really just feel a bit a bit spoiled and just really grateful so I'm really really happy with everything as I said do keep an eye out for my next video I'm going to be talking more about the multicolor pieces where I got them how much the condition I think I might even do another separate video on my pochette and cleaning it up um because it is a bit worn it does need a good clean I've got lots of good products that will hopefully bring it back to life a bit more whereas the cosmetic pouch is really really in amazing condition but i might just put some protector cream on that one but i'll definitely be restoring this one a little bit more so that will also be in another upcoming video so keep an eye out for that one so i had a really lovely birthday and thank you to everyone who did wish me a happy birthday on instagram if you don't follow me already i am at luxury and life uk and i also have a blog as well which is luxury and life.co.uk and please do subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't already i'd love to have you back for more videos and thanks again for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye